At the top of each channel strip is the pull down menu to save a channel strip setting, which is an entire plugin chain. There's an option lower left to create a new subfolder. I'll create a new folder for my singer for this song. This is the main chorus vocal, so I'll specify the song title screwed up. So now I've saved that channel strip setting, and in fact, you can already see it over here in the library to the right of the arrange window. Now the next time my singer gets on the mic and it's the same kind of project, I can quickly call up this plug-in setting chain and she'll immediately sound good. I'll have an EQ, compressor, reverb, de -esser. It sounds great on her voice and then I'll just have to do a little bit of tweaking to the particular performance. Channel strip settings are available for audio tracks, software instrument tracks, and also for the main output. If I select the main output, you can see that there are a whole set here which are in effect mastering and analysis settings from the factory. I've seen the Logic sessions of more than a few hit songs that use these Logic channel strip settings straight from the factory. 